Okay, I think we're live on air. So, hi Marcus. Um, hi Luke. To a bit of a trial run of a live hangout on air. Uh, we're here uh, today because we want to have a little bit of a talk about Citrion 1. Um, I know that there's a team of people who are putting lots of effort into um, Citrion's new mobile development platform called Citrion 1 and you are leading the charge on that. So I thought it'd be worth taking like 10, 15 minutes um, just to talk through what Citrion 1 is all about, um, some of the business challenges it solves and uh, you know, the, sort of, the sort of things that, that customers um, you know, might get when they start using Citrion 1. So why don't you start off with uh, telling us what Citrion 1 is. Sure. Thanks, Luke. So basically, Citrion 1 is a really innovative enterprise mobile platform. And it's uh, really like a new approach when it comes to um, building, hosting, and deploying mobile apps for corporate users. And um, the Citrion 1 platform actually runs completely in the cloud. So we are hosting a mobile uh, infrastructure for our customers in Microsoft Azure and um, developers, regular .NET developers can actually use tools like Visual Studio to build uh, cross-platform native apps. So in Visual Studio you can actually configure what we call micro apps that are connected to backend systems like SAP, Oracle, PeopleSoft, but also to SharePoint and SQL Server and web services and um, really publish them to the cloud and these micro apps instantly show up within the Citrion 1 container app. So the idea is to have a rapid, uh, rapid modeling tool for mobile apps and publishing those uh, mobile apps to hundreds or thousands of devices without the need of using uh, mobile device management. So what you can actually do is this is a pure BYOD approach, you can actually send a link to all your employees and users and tell them, hey, just download the Citrion 1 app from the Apple App Store or the Windows Phone Marketplace or the Google Marketplace, log on with your ADFS credentials and boom, you're in your uh, corporate network. So it's really, it's really exciting because um, I think there's no one out there that can actually build cross-platform um, native mobile apps within a couple of hours that are already connected to large enterprise systems like SAP. There is no need actually for any kind of new infrastructure on-prem. There is no need for uh, hiring uh, native mobile developers. It's all built on the tools that we love and like, like Visual Studio, TFS, and uh, Microsoft Azure. So, Marcus, I mean, I've been working with the team uh, on this for the last couple of weeks, and mm -hmm. Um, you know, I've been helping to record some of the voiceovers for the training videos, and one of the things that I've learned is that it's so easy to do this. Yeah. Um, I don't know anything about being a mobile developer, but I've been able to make some really simple mobile apps um, so. <laughs> uh, uh, really easily. So, yeah. I mean, what what kind of makes it so easy? Like, what, what's what's the underlying principles behind the ease of this this platform? Yeah, so there is two very important things that I want to highlight. First of all, uh, we have a very, very um, good good um, tool for enterprise backend system integration. So our so-called Citrion MDK, the mobile development kit, ships with pre-built-in adapters for systems like SAP and SharePoint. So in Visual Studio, you can actually connect to your enterprise systems, you can discover all the processes and data that are actually stored and hosted in those systems, and you can pull them into your uh, Visual Studio environment. And then our MDK actually generates all the view models, all the, the services that you need to then connect it to a user interface. And that's the second highlight here. So we have a visual designer that allows you to um, create and configure your mobile screens and really leverage the native power of the devices. So if you want to build an app that takes your GPS position and connects it to customer data in SAP or even in SharePoint or in cloud systems like Salesforce, that's easy. If you need to upload pictures to, to one of your on-prem systems and then trigger actions in, in SAP or in SharePoint, you can do this. So it's really a mix of 
enterprise-ready tools for connecting to your LOB systems, combined with a very easy-to-use visual designer for creating native, native apps, right? And then yeah. when you're ready, you just publish it to uh, your mobile tenant in our Citroen One Cloud on Azure, and instantly your app is available on all devices. Cool. I mean, yeah, it seemed when I've used it to be to be pretty simple. Uh, I can only imagine people who actually have an understanding of what it, what being a developer is, the kind of things they might be able to do. If we put aside all of the technical talk, <laughs> give me an, give me some use cases. You know, if I'm a typical business user, say if I'm an HR manager or or someone who's a typical business user inside an enterprise, what are the kind of things that this app could help me to tackle? Yeah, so there are actually endless possibilities. Every use case that you have internally in terms of um, having mobile apps for your employees or managers can actually build with Citroen One. So to give you some examples, we got customers who are doing uh, all their time recording with Citroen One. So they got SAP and Oracle backend systems uh, where they actually maintain their resources, their capacities, and even their project planning. And then all their consultants are using Citroen One for tracking their billable hours, tracking their um, days off. So thousands of people using their corporate but also their personal phones to have a real-time interaction with the underlying uh, on-prem heavy lifting backend systems like SAP and Oracle. Another great use case is like in sales. So uh, we got customers who have both Salesforce and SAP. So product information and um, materials and all this stuff is actually in SAP, but all sales-related stuff is in Salesforce. But when sales folks are actually traveling around and are on site as a customer, they really easily want to get all the consolidated information. So this customer build apps that connect to Salesforce and to SAP in parallel, blending and merging the data together and presenting all the stuff real time on an iPad, on an iPhone, on an Android device, and on a Windows phone. And there are more, right? So you can you can become really creative. Uh, we got customers using our stuff in retail stores. Uh, you just use our integrated barcode scanners scan a product, uh, send the data back to your on-prem uh, systems, get all the information back, including product pictures, uh, reviews. Um, yeah, so the end. Uh, the possibilities are really endless here. Um, it sounds uh, it sounds pretty exciting. I know that um, you know it's uh, it's available now, and people can download it if if. If someone who's watching this broadcast wanted to uh, get some more information yep. or to start to play with Citroen One development platform, like where should they go to do that? Yeah, that's extremely simple. So you just go to citroen.com slash one, and that's the central site where you can actually register for Citroen One. So we're going to spin up your own mobile tenant. Um, you can download the Citroen One MDK. Uh, you can install all the adapters, and actually we got some pretty cool tutorials. And look, you actually built two of them. Thanks for that. Um, that can actually get you started in just 10 minutes. So, for instance, we got one sample app, and you can also download the source code there that allows you to uh, use one of our SQL servers in uh, Azure, where we got some sample data. So you can, you can build an app in like 10 minutes that takes your, your geolocation, send it to a SQL database on Azure, retrieving all the customer information, and um, yeah, just displaying all the stuff on, on your uh, mobile device's native app. So that's, that's extremely, extremely exciting for .NET developers, because we can, we can enable you guys out there to build native apps with your existing skills in .NET and use the tools you love, like Visual Studio 2013. Cool. Um, look, I think that gives us a really good overview of what this is about, and you know, I encourage anyone out there who is interested in Citroen One to reach out to us, um, download the MDK, start to play around with it. Uh, we've got a great team here who are looking to, looking to um, uh, support any new customers who come on board. So 
Uh, thanks, Marcus, for taking out the time. Thanks, Luke. And uh, yeah, we'll uh, chat to you again soon. Take care. Bye-bye.